Scores of protesters have clashed with police in Istanbul's Sultangazi district during an effort to mark the one-year anniversary of the biggest anti-government protests in decades. Police fired tear gas and water cannons to disperse protesters who responded by throwing stones and petrol bombs, with two appearing to take aim at police with handguns. On May 31, 2013, police forcefully evicted environmentalists from Gezi Park, who had staged a peaceful sit-in for several days to try to stop government plans to raise the green space and build a shopping mall. Angered by the use of violence, tens of thousands of people descended on Gezi and occupied Taksim Square for around two weeks before authorities used force to finally clear the space, killing six people, including one police officer. Many complained of what they saw as growing authoritarianism after Erdogan's decade in office. Erdogan and his party have controlled Turkish politics for the past 10 years and have been pushing for European Union membership, but his party has taken major hits with a series of scandals and a heavy crackdown on social media websites, blocking popular sites such as Twitter and YouTube. Although the bans have now been overturned by the courts, the damage is likely already done. In the past few months, various European leaders have voiced a strong opposition to Turkey's EU bid.